Hi, this is a demonstration video of how to fix the Web360 Mega into the, the issue of login first. So, first thing you need to do is you need to go to the website, shibisat.com, and then go to support and software. All the softwares for all the devices should be there. If there's anything missing, just let us know and we'll update it for you. The instructions are also there. So, you need to download the right file for your US for your box, put it into your speed drive, flash drive, put the flash drive into the box, and then go into settings, press OK, and then go to software upgrade, press OK, and then choose file path, press OK, and then press OK again on USB, make sure you choose the right file, when you choose the right file, you press OK, and then you press start. It will automatically upgrade the latest software. While it's upgrading, um, what you need to do is uh, make sure the USB stays on the box until it's fully restarted. And um, that should fix all the issues of, of your code or anything like that. So once it's all fully loaded, all you have to do is just leave it and then let it do its uh, upgrade. And then once it's done, you know, it should work. If it doesn't work, or you're having other issues with, or you can't get through this menu, and you need further support, you can go back to our support uh, website, and then uh, there's a number there which you can call, and the technical team will support you over the phone, or you can email us as well, which is uh, info at shibisat.com, and uh, they will respond to your email. Okay, so this will take about 50 seconds maybe to 60 seconds about, about a minute and then once it's done um, that should solve all the problems okay let's just wait and see when the upload is finished as you can see the box is restarting itself now so once it's restarted We'll go back to normal state. This will take a few seconds, so you need to wait. As you can see, there's no menu showing on the screen, so you need to wait till it's done. So now it's going to come up with the menu. You can see everything's back. And you still have to wait a few more seconds for the internet to connect. Once that's connected, you press the TV and that should work. Any issues, like I said, just give us a call. I hope this video is very helpful. Please don't forget to leave a feedback. Drop us an email, the feedback, and if you need any more videos or support, just let us know, we'll upload it.